deep in the lands of Zara. The humans of Koopa Keep struggle to stay alive as they are attacked by the wicked drow elves of Larnia. Darkness falls as the humans beg their king to save them, a noble king known only as the Grand Wizard. For a thousand years, the battle has been waged, with only the bravery of the Grand Wizard to protect his human followers. But even though the Wizard King is so undeniably cool, the Drow Elf armies continue their attacks. They seek the human's most treasured relic, the Stick of Truth. But the tides of war soon change, as news of a new kid spreads throughout the land. In order to save the humans, the Grand Wizard must get to the new kid, before the Drow Elves can manipulate his man and use him to take the sacred relic from human hands. For whomever controls the stick, controls the universe. Well, I think that's everything. We did it, hun. We're really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on, let's see how he's doing. Sweetie, hun, you all dressed? Hey, champ. How do you like your new room? I know it's a big change for all of us, but, son, do you remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? He doesn't remember. He doesn't remember at all. That's good. That's good he doesn't remember. Uh, sweetie, we want you to have lots of fun here. Why don't you go out and make some friends? Right. Get outside and play, son. Like, like normal kids. We've got some money for you on the kitchen counter, sweetie. Just be back before it gets dark. Yeah, we love you too. Go on outside, sweetie. Come on, son. Get out there. Make friends.
shall die by my Warhammer, Drow Elf. Nuh-uh, I banish thee to the forest realm. That way I pay no fare, that's cheating. I'm gonna tell my mom. Thanks, kid. I didn't realize he had a health potion. Uh, my name is Butters the Merciful. I'm a paladin. I live right next door to you. We should be friends. Now that we're friends, you should speak with the Wizard King. He's been talking about your arrival. The wizard lives this way, in the greenhouse, over there. Hey, where are you from? Where'd you live before moving here? So, you are the new kid. Your coming was foretold by Coldwell Banker. I am the Wizard King. But the time for talk is not now. Let me show you my kingdom. Oh, who's your new friend, Eric? Shut up, Mom. Not now. Don't talk to her. She's not part of the game. Welcome to the kingdom of Koopa Keep. Our weapon shop here is tended by Clyde, a level 14 warrior. Here you can see our massive stables, overseen by the level 9 ranger, Scott Malkinson, who has the power of diabetes. And here, of course, is the breathtaking and lovely Princess Kinney, the fairest maiden in all the kingdom. Don't ask why Kinney wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. You may have heard of my deeds at the Battle of Stark's Pod. My loyalty is as incurable as my diabetes. My job is to deliver the Wizard King's justice and his mail. You have been sought out, new kid, because humans everywhere are in great danger. I need something from you, and in return, I am prepared to allow you into my kingdom. I know you are very excited. It's time for your first quest, but first, please tell us thy name. You entered Douchebag, is that correct? Are you sure you want to keep the name Douchebag? Very well, Douchebag. You will now choose a class. Fighter, Mage, Thief, or Jew. A Mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. You look sneaky enough to be a thief. Jew, huh? So I guess we'll never really be friends. You look sneaky enough to be a thief. A Mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. We welcome to our kingdom, Douchebag the Mage. Hooray! Now please, go and visit the weapon shop. Procure yourself a weapon and we shall teach you to fight. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Perhaps you would like to hear tips and rumors for two dollars? Don't waste your money on tips and rumors. Don't let it bother you that there's a game to be played. That doesn't fit your class, stupid. Ah, a lovely purchase. You have procured a weapon. Nice. It's now time to teach you how to fight. I want you to take your new weapon and, with the bravery of a noble knight, beat up Clyde. What? Kick Clyde's ass, new kid. What I do? I'm the king, Clyde, and the king wishes to be amused. 
Go on, new kid, kick his ass. I'm gonna kick your ass. Clyde, you have to wait your turn. That's lame. No, Clyde, it's like olden times. You have to wait your turn. Like in the Middle Ages, Clyde. I know it's lame, Clyde, but that's how we're fucking doing it. All right, douchebag, bash Clyde's face in. Don't be shy. Clyde's your bitch. All right, Clyde's wearing armor. In order to hurt him, I want you to hit Clyde as hard as you can. Ugh. Oh shit, dude, I think I see blood. Fucking nice, bro. It's exactly what you do to guys with armor like that. Okay, listen up. The key to surviving in battle is not to get hit in the bows. Clyde, it's your turn to attack. Douchebag, protect your bows. Prepare yourself. Ugh. No, no, I said protect. Protect your bows. This does double damage. No, that's not blocking, that's sucking. Try again. Ah. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about! Dude, you're already way better than Clyde. All right, it's time to use your heroic powers. Using your ability takes power points, or PP for short. <laughs> PP. <laughs> if you have a fucking better name for them, then fucking say it, Clyde! Fucking asshole! I'm the king, and I say it's PP. Douchebag, use your mage ability to make Clyde pay for insulting the king. Didn't count. Ah. Dude, that was pretty lame. Try it again, dude. that smile off his stupid face, douchebag. Now do it one more time. Finish him. What? I was going easy. Take this. Yeah. Sick. Sick. Ouch. <laughs> You were all like, Bleh! and Clyde was all like, nah, nah. <laughs> Okay, okay, you prove yourself worthy, douchebag. Now come inside the war tent and I shall let you see the relic. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Well, here it is. The reason why humans and elves are locked in a never-ending war. The relic for which human and elf are willing to die. The Stick of Truth. Just two days ago, we took the stick back from the elves. Our kingdom was dying, but now it thrives. For whoever controls the stick, controls the universe. Don't gaze at it too long, for its power is too much for mere mortals to look at. Now that you have seen the Stick of Truth, let's discuss your dues. Being a member of my kingdom costs $9.95 for the first week, $4 of which is tax deductible. Alarm! 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 Someone has sounded the alarm! 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 What is it? The elves are attacking! Oh my god! Defensive positions! Douchebag, come help us! Man the gate! Don't let them through! Give us the stick, humans! Fuck you, Drow Elf! Come and get it! Clyde, guard the stick of truth while we defend the fortress! Aye, aye! Aye, aye! We're not playing pirates, Clyde! Douchebag, this is your chance to prove yourself. Hold off the asshole elves at all costs! Oh, you want some of this? Gage! Do it, douchebag. Kick these elves' asses. You want some of this? You're wounded, douchebag. Potions will heal you. Here. Rules say you can have one potion every turn. I asked for five, but this was a compromise. This guy's fast, douchebag. Try to block all his attacks. Well, if this job doesn't work out, at least you've got a future as a training dummy. Come on, get it right. You're mine now. Uh. I 
said block, not get nailed by? Maybe I wasn't clear. Try again. Fuck you. <laughs> okay, if you block all the attacks, you get a counterattack. Look at your enemy on the ground. Weak and helpless. Kick the shit out of him. Awesome, you kicked his helpless ass. Now finish off these elves in the name of the Wizard King. Take that! like that. You need to try a different tactic to damage him. Look at that archer hiding behind his friend like a wood. Switch to your arrows, douchebag. Snipe that little bitch. Sweet, now you can hit the guy in the back. Go for the pink mist. Yeah. Douchebag, use your arrows. Take out the archer. Do what I say or you can't play anymore. Uh. Yeah, bitch, that's what you get for fucking with the wizard king. You. Careful, douchebag. That guy's ready for your arrows now. You gotta try something else. Ah. Great job, douchebag. What was that for? Kick their asses, new kid. I got you back. Ah. Let's do this, douchebag. Okay, that guy has a shield. Shields are super weak. Just hit them with your simplest hit over and over to wear them down quickly. Bitch! Uh, hell yeah, that's how you do it. The other elf let his guard down. Now's your chance. Power attack his armor. That's it! Now finish him! Now! The stick of truth. The elves got it. That was your one goddamn job, Clyde! To guard the stick of fucking truth! Clyde, you are hereby banished from space and time! What? No! You can't do that! Yeah, I can! You're banished and lost in time and space! Yeah, go home, Clyde! You fought bravely on the battlefield, douchebag. Yeah, if you can make me a douchebag, like you sure can't fight! Shut up, Scott, nobody cares what you think. Anyways, we have a bigger problem now. The Stick of Truth has been stolen, and we must assemble our entire army in order to get it back. But our three best warriors still haven't reported for duty, my king. Our newest member can take care of that. Douchebag, I want you to go out into the neighborhood and find my greatest warriors, Token, Tweak, and Craig. I'm texting their pictures to your personal inventory device now. But beware, the lands outside are full of marauding drow elves, monsters, and sixth graders. Be sure you're well equipped. Now go, and send my warriors here. Fighters, go with him. Guess I'm minding your shop now. You need any weapons or armor? You name it, we'll sell it!
you kids be careful now. Uh, this is the king's room. I don't think we're supposed to be in here. What exactly? Wow, Eric has a lot of cool stuff. This is where the magic happens. Last week, Cartman's mom was here with a few men having a whole lot of magic. She was doing hand magic and butt magic. We aren't allowed to go into the street. We're such an open world, our parents don't want us getting hurt. But those are holy icons from the Orient. Legend has it that he who can collect enough will be rewarded. The Wizard King says I'm too ginger to be one of the humans, but Paladin Butters lets me be his squire on the slide. Paladins seek justice for all races. <laughs> Hold many dangers, new kids. Yeah, you moved to the wrong realm. Nice hair, douchebag. Take this. You want some of this? Fuck you. You're hurt. This looks like a job for Paladin Butter. I got your back, yo. Ugh, that beat. I better wait a turn before I do any more healing.
sorry, but we can't be friends until you have more friends. Well, hey, Officer Butt Baby. I'll be That's Butt Brady. Wait. This here is the marketplace. This is where heroes can come for adventuring gear, nose jabs, and abortions. Let's just keep this between us, okay? Because we're such good friends! <laughs> this movie is really sweet. Too bad you guys can't see it. Hey, over here. Hey, you can't let me see a movie? Oh, that's right, you can't, because you traded it up. Don't worry, I'm not here to hurt you. It's me, Al Gore! You know, Al Gore, I'm super important. All right, look, I've detected some very strange activity in this area. I believe we are dealing with Man Bear Pig. Yes, the Man Bear Pig. I know you're scared, but I need help. Take these and place them in the location specified on the Man Bear map, Pig. And now I'm going to make you my friend on Facebook. This is very prestigious. You have my email now, but don't give it out to anybody. I'm super serial. Hurry, we must know if Man Bear Pig is here or not. Shouldn't you be in school? Welcome to Tweet Coffee. Coffee made with ingredients supplied by local organic suppliers. It's local coffee, brewed locally. Tweak? Tweak! <laughs> Have you picked up the fresh local ingredients? Uh, not yet, Dad. I'm still trying to do all my chores. Well, hurry up, son. The family business is relying on you. <laughs> Give me a swirly in that public bathroom over there one time. Come play hide and seek with us. You're it. people who are renting the guest house out in the back.
Yeah, yeah, we got the package for Tweet Coffee. You got the envelope? Hey, that's not the usual kid that picks up the package. Huh? Oh, shit. It's a kip! Ah, uh, hamburgers. Doctors must be cooking up a secret potion. Oh, huh? it's a healing potion. How'd you feel to totally not be able to heal any tears in that movie? Where's today's delivery? Right here! Hmm, yep, that's good shit. All right, Tweak, you can play for a little bit. But be home before dark or you'll be grounded. Grounded, like the fresh grinds of our all-organic Tweak blend, made with ingredients from local tweakers. Thanks, kid. I gotta go get changed and then I'll meet you at the kingdom. You should try some coffee. It gives you... Welcome to my coffee shop. Thanks for helping Tweak out in the back room. Would you like to try some coffee? The stick is on! 
It's totally awesome to be mature like me and not immature like you twerp. This is If you try again, I will pepper spray you back to the Stone Age. Sure is a lot of walking. Stan one time gave me the grossest wet willy right here. I couldn't decide where to hide. Come on, give me a reason. Jimbo and Ned. What? Howdy there. Haven't seen you before. You must be the new kid that moved to town. And you're into hunting, huh? Well, my boy, you've come to the right place. South Park is chock full of things to shoot that would delight any taxidermist, survivalist, or weekend animal death enthusiast. Ain't much I can sell. A guide to South Park Wildlife is everything a hunter needs to know about the beasts of Scott some things for sale by You're a douche. Ah, shit. my wolf security system. I refuse to be the victim of a white burglar or a white serial killer. I won't... What the fuck? Oh, no! Ah, uh, hamburgers! Oh! Long. Ow! 
Oh Yeah? Can I help you? What's this? Oh, the elf stick the stick again? Hang on a second. Thank you for thy message, traveler. I shall make haste to Koopa Keep. Mom, can you drive me to Eric's house? Move along, sir. I can't look at you without feelings of deep personal shame. You better keep walking. Once I get beat up behind that house. You looking for Craig? Well, he can't play. He's in detention. Something about flipping off the principal. Oh, no! Craig's in jail! We gotta go tell the Grand Wizard! Oh, you want some of this? Douchebag. Now all my men are here and ready to fight for the... Wait a minute. Where's Feldspar? Where's my level 12 thief? Uh, hey, yeah. Where's Craig? He's in detention. What? He flipped off the principal, so he's in detention again. Oh, my God. If they've locked away our thief in detention, we have no hope of getting back the stick of truth. We have to break him out. Ah, no way, man. Last time we broke Craig out of detention, we all got in trouble. Getting into trouble is a risk that Douchebag is willing to take. You have to break out our thief, Douchebag. But don't worry, I will not let you go unprepared. I'm going to teach you how to use magic. Meet me at the training barracks. It's time for you to learn Dragon Shout. You fight well, douchebag. But to truly succeed in combat, you must learn to harness the power of your farts. Farting on an opponent at precisely the right time is key to battle. I shall show you how it's done, but first, you must take the gentleman's oath. You must promise to never, ever fart on anyone's bows, okay? Farting on an opponent is necessary, but farting on someone's bows is not cool. Do you understand? All right, then let's begin your training. To conjure dragon shouts, you must first clear your mind and take in a deep breath through your butthole. Like so. Huh? Then let it rumble inside you and dragon shout. I'll show you one more time. Suck it in. Let it rumble. Dragon shout. Now you. Ready? Dragon shout! Find the freak. Hold! Hold! My god, that was incredible. 
A man could live a hundred years and never again witness a spell so boisterous. Could it be that the prophecies are true? Could it be that the dragonborn has come at last in our hour of need? Now let us try your skill on a real opponent. Hey, hey, Princess Kenny. <laughs> could you come here a sec? <laughs> Shh, don't time. Okay. Just real quick, Princess Kenny. Sir Douchebag wants to show you something. All right, you two. Spar! Sir Douchebag, show Princess Kenny the magical powers I have taught you. <laughs> Douchebag, don't get all shy on me now. Show her the trick. Douchebag, that was sweet. Thanks, Princess Kenny. That's all for now. Thank you, asshole. <laughs> okay, okay, but dude, seriously, remember, don't ever do that on someone's boss. Okay, seriously. You have mastered dragon shafts. From now on, it will be easier for you. Kenny will assist you on your quest, douchebag. Now go get Craig while I rest and relax upon my throne. <laughs> 